crispy. Yeah, that'll lay a... That will what? Lay a turd. Oh. But I'm not gonna say the turd part, I'm just gonna cut. No, but we're yeah. definitely adding that part now. Now that you're explaining it, you just have to, because if I have to say what for it, you gotta tell the audience, no, you know. we'll put it in the end, at the end of the episode. Oh yeah, we could do that. Like the blooper reel. Yeah. Ooh. Bomb. Trailbenders Overland is presented by Stockham Media and supporting sponsor, The Waterport. This spot on Lake Mead is one for the books and definitely somewhere we will be returning to again. As with most places, we didn't know what to expect pulling in last night, but this place is pure gold. The water was warm, we had the beach to ourselves. The weather was perfect. It doesn't get any better than this. We're up for a quick swim, breakfast, then packing up camp to move on to the next location. What you cooking, Dilly? I'm making eggs. Making eggs and what? Sausage. Dang. Italian. I'm gonna throw some spinach in there. Mmm. Ooh, crispy. Some dude just freaking bounced without a sandal. You know, I bet he got home. He's like, dude, where's my sandal at? Yeah. <laughs> well, it's right there. Tonight was the first night that uh, we tried out the Tough Stuff uh, Elite tent. And oh my gosh, it's like a king size bed up there. You can fit five people up there. Oh, it was so nice and convenient. Oh, man. Dylan spent tons and tons of hours sewing that tent. Turned out pretty good. good All right, taste test. Legitimately, that's pretty dang good. Alright, I need more. Mm. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad at all. Yeah, that'll lay a sandbar. Yeah, yeah. Whoa! <laughs> what? <laughs> Swimming was a success. Woo! Swimming was a 
Dang, Dilly, you blind. Oh. <laughs> there you go, Dilly. That was a success. Well, now time to uh, do the hairdo and get on the road. The rodeo go. The rodeo go. Uh, anytime that I go fishing, it will be at this spot for sure. Uh, you need a truck to get down here. Or you can take your car and do one of those hoof it. Use your Lambrafitis and get down here. Lambra. Yeah, bring your Lambo out here. No, your Lambrafitis. Your Lambrafitis? Like a Lamborghini, but instead, your Lambrafitis. Like you're hoofing it. Please oh, forgive my friend. Yeah, bring your Lambrafitis. Yeah. Get it. He gets it, guys. This was so cool. So just got done at the beach. Now to wash off. Always gotta carry this with me. Thanks to the water port. We're finished with pack up and it's time to hit the road. We're heading back to Zion National Park to tackle the Narrows. It's a short trek there, but we have to keep moving. books for, for next time that uh, we come out in this area. We'll have a nice place to swim. Um, now we're off to Zion, which is 167 miles. Um, and we'll see what we have in store when we get there. Oh yeah, sounds good. That spot was definitely a success. That was awesome. That's more refreshing. Finally made it to Zion. Uh, yeah, so Dylan's been on the phone this whole time. Wait, are you on the iPad or? So, we're gonna be hiking the Narrows. Or at least that's the plan. Designations such as National Park, National Monument, National Historic Site, National Recreation Area, National Park Service, National Park Service,
what TBO is. And we say TBO is Trailbenders Overland. We're a vehicle based enthusiast, off road enthusiast, that travel the country and document really cool camping sites, really cool trails, and really cool parks, I guess. There's something a mile in front of us that we're walking to, but I couldn't tell you what it is. Poison this is what poison ivy like. looks like. Nice. That's smooth branches. Don't ever walk into it, because you'll be sorry if Unless you do. You're me. Unless you're Dylan and mutant and, and immune, immune to totally. poison ivy. Dang, you're mutant. <laughs> I'm immune to all things bad. <laughs> Probably used to getting fed. Yeah. Oh, it feels so good. I just want to just sit in it. <laughs> I'm gonna try not to get my feet wet all the way across. Oh, too late. This is epic. Steven said the Narrows would be awesome. But I didn't realize it would be this awesome. This trail is your chance to walk the icy Virgin River and be more at one with Zion's beauty. All right, let's do this. Huh? Is your shoe full of water? No, I didn't even get my feet wet. Nah, you lying. <laughs> the Narrows is the most narrow portion of Zion Canyon. And sometimes being only 20 feet wide and with thousand foot walls, this place makes you really feel small. You can always count on Steven to come up with some goofy ideas. What's up YouTube, this is Spider-Man. <laughs> Who the heck was that guy? Well, someone came up with a bright idea to float down this freezing river. And it wasn't me. <laughs> Mr. North Carolina is like, do it for the subscribers. Well, North Carolina? Yeah. Mr. North Carolina is like, do it for the subscribers. And look, we did it for the subscribers. We did it for the subscribers. So, hey, when you see this, comment. Let us know it's you. Yeah, let us know. Why did we just do that? Dude, you made me do it last night. That was so cool. I talked I talked the boys to going down. What is this? The, the Virgin River, right? I believe so. I believe it's the Virgin River. Oh! Oh! Create the fire! <laughs> Let's go to that cave. That thing just got oh, God, submerged. How bad did it get? Submerged completely. Can I dry it on Take something? Take the memory card out right away. I'm not kidding. That's gonna expose it to Michael. You gotta take it out. Here. Here. You gonna give it to me? Give it to me. Why'd you do that? You did it for the subscriber, man. <laughs> did it for the subscribers. Did it for the subscribers. Drop my camera in the water. How about okay, that? Okay, don't don't zoom in and out. Uh, probably take the battery out, yeah? Yeah, take the battery out right now. This was a huge bummer for Michael, as he won't be able to use his camera for the rest of the trip. The first thing you want to do in this situation is pull the battery out, then the memory card. 
Try your best not to focus or zoom your lens in and out to try and avoid getting more water inside the lens. Whoa, whoa! I have done this to a camera before. And after letting it sit in a bag of rice for a couple months, it ended up being fine. This is, however, a good reminder that sometimes you should be extra careful. You never know when you might slip. Made it. Oh my god! <laughs> oh, really? Uh, he actually so fell in the water with his camera. Oh my god. It's oh, dude, is it waterproof or was it? No. Oh no! Oh. Yeah, it, oh, that man. happened. What's up? <laughs> yeah, say what's up. Steven. What's up, y'all? Hey. How's it going? <laughs> Steven's like, yo, let's float down the river. I'm like, heck no. This guy's like, do it for the subscribers. Do it for the subscribers every time. <laughs> right? Subscribers are always right. <laughs> <laughs> well, then go subscribe. I am. Well. I'll be the 1300th and one. Dang. <laughs> That'd be awesome. That's the one. All right, y'all. Yeah, we gotta get this new guy a subscriber. Yeah. If you haven't already, <laughs> subscribe you don't for the. I don't know. You don't Patreon. <laughs> you should. You should. What was your name? I'm Jeremy. Dylan. Yeah, good to see Steven. you. Nice to meet you, Steven. Nice to meet you, too. Oh, 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 oh. Hey, that's the best kind of handshake right there. <laughs> Michael, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you guys. Nice to meet you, guys. Nice to meet you guys. Good luck, y'all. Have fun. Dude, doesn't matter where you go, you're always going to meet genuinely awesome and amazing people. Oh yeah. That was just a prime example right there. Come on, Dilly. We'll be, we'll be fine, we'll make it. <laughs> Do not miss that one. So, he wasn't just a favorite yet. I guess if you guys have requests, yeah, let us know. He wasn't a subscriber, but he will be. Dylan will literally do anything that you guys hey. ask. <laughs> and Steven said that if there's any, if I ever need help with anything, Dang. he's always there. <laughs> to reinforce? To support? What do you think of Zion? It was pretty extraordinary, I will say. I think we got some good footage, pretty stoked. We officially made it back to the bus. That was a cool adventure. What do you think, Dylan? It was epic. Met a couple of new Way friends, cool. new subscribers. New subscribers. That's some cool stuff. So now we'll get back to the truck, get uh, changed over, <laughs> switch out these wet socks and shoes. And then, wet. Yeah, it's been nice. And then we're going to push over to um, where are we going tonight? We're going to Page. We're going to Page. We're going to go to Horseshoe Bend. Get some uh, astro photography and then push it up to. No, well, right here next to it is Elma. And a little valley. We got a tour we're doing tomorrow. Canyon. Sorry, Canyon. So we're just gonna. Uh, it would be sweet if we could find a camp spot on that. On the edge of the canyon or something. That would be cool. That'd be awesome. All right, we will see you back in about 15 minutes. Ready to push? Ready to die. Huh? Ready to die. Mmm. I want to some more pretzels. What? I want to some more pretzels. It's all about the Beatles, bro. You want pretzels? Steven said he wants some pretzels here. Dang! Dang! <laughs> As you can tell, we're just a few buds on an awesome trip, having a good time. Let this be a reminder to you that it's so easy to get out and go. With friends or even alone. Stay safe and have a good time. 
we're on our way to Page, Arizona. We're gonna check out Horseshoe Bend and see if we can find a campsite that will keep us close to Antelope Canyon. All right, so we just made it to our camp spot, and uh, we just camp got to... Spot. Sorry. <laughs> We're tired. I'm tired. Super tired. It's really late. We just lost an hour, so uh, we just got to our camp spot. Um, we went to... Horseshoe Bend earlier mm -hmm. and got some pictures. And we were gonna, pictures. yeah, we got some uh, got some type of pictures and then uh, not sweet, but some type. Some type, yeah. <laughs> we weren't. We were supposed to grill out tonight. We we're supposed to have do burgers, but since we lost an hour, we just went to Taco Bell, got some grub. Shh, don't tell anybody. Yeah, don't tell nobody. Um, <laughs> yeah, so we just put up the uh, the tents. We're about to get some sleep and then. We'll see you guys early, early in the morning. Early in the morning, five thirty. Five thirty a.m. Reveille. We have to be up. Yeah. Yoga. Mandatory. Mandatory. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We that will see bad. you guys then. Or 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 see you at another time. Oh, you turd. Have you ever seen a loving man? Yeah. We'll what? see you then, or I'll see you at another time. Wait, that was very confusing. I don't yeah. know if you're actually going to be there. All right, man. Yeah. Oh, bring, bring it in. Oh. oh, and I don't know. Oh, dang. Do <laughs> you need to say that? Well, I can cut it in. No, well, well I was just going to say, um, I don't know if you guys know this, but tonight's my last night here, so I'm not excited about it. But I'm happy that I got to go on this trip, so. I'm not excited about it either, but, yeah, it is great that you're here. Yeah. Here. But... We'll get more into that tomorrow, and we'll part ways and, you know, do all that fun stuff, so. All right, bring it in. Next on Trailbenders Overland. It's Stephen and Michael's first time in Antelope Canyon. And we get to meet some awesome new friends. <laughs> 